Alright, so I'm back with another unboxing. This time it's going to go back to my figurines. It's... I ordered her, or this figure, how oh, many days was it? A week ago? And she just arrived this morning. And basically we can save her. I'm going to put my cutting tool. So give me a moment. Um, I could have swore I put it down here. Hold on, I'm looking for my knife. Oh, here it is. Anyways, yeah, this is a saber. And of course, I already have a whole bunch of saber. You haven't noticed over there. But that's okay. I'm looking forward to collecting a bunch of saber stuff. Because I'm a big fan of her character. Let's get this open. Uh, pretty cheap. A lot cheaper than most places were selling it. I got it from my user on figure.fm. Pretty active on there. So, looking forward to this figure. There's nothing too. Um, too extravagant, it's very simple figure. So yeah. But uh I'm looking forward to it. So, so this one's my altar. It's very small. Very petite. Well she's a lot smaller than I thought. A lot smaller. Okay. So let's take a closer okay. look. So there it is. It's a pretty small box. Like look at my hand. This, this is my hand. It's basically the size of my hand. So it's a 1 8 scale. It's from the Fate Hollow series. I believe that's a sequel to Fate Stay Night, if, I'm, if I remember correctly. And it's Saber in her. or it's Alter Saber by Alter. In her kind of like simple outfit. So let's get some. It is used. I don't really care for the box. I'm not one of those people where I need a perfect box, to be honest. It's more of the figures. As long as the figures intact, I'm pretty happy. Trying to get in frame. Oh, she's really tiny. So tiny. <laughs> and some people are selling her for 200 I mean, That's ridiculous. Of course she's, I don't know, she's, of course she's, she's not sold um, officially anymore. So I can see why the price. But this person was selling her at a more reasonable price. So I jumped on it. Yeah. The only thing I really hate about this uh, figure is the base. I don't know why they went with yellow. They should just went with a clear base at the least. I mean, why, why, why would you go with this color? It makes no sense. It like, has no relation to the whole theme of the figure. But whatever. Get all this tape off. And let's get the tape out. So apparently she's, uh, <laughs> she's dead. Got cut in half. So, she disconnects. Say what so. Don't worry, I'll make it more detailed throughout the video. And there you go. The skirt also. Whoa. That was close. Anyways, the skirt's two piece apparently. It's okay. Not damaged. It just fell. I just gotta wipe this down. Still get a little bit dirty. Yep. Alright, so let me get her standing and then. I'll get my review and thoughts on it. Alright, so finally got her assembled. And first thing right off the bat, I noticed she's really, really tiny. <laughs> I mean, that could be a bad thing, good thing, you know. It's whatever's for me. No big deal. And yep, she's really small. Here's the size of my hand. Of course, I do have a big hand. But anyway, she's really petite, which is nice. But uh, overall, I think Alter did a really nice job on this. It's very simple, very basic, nothing too out of the ordinary. And yep, let's get into detail. So, you can see the skirt has a lot of ruffles in it, which is really nice. It's actually two piece. The gray part is uh, one piece, then the black part is one piece, as you saw in the previous video. And there you go. The skirt's uh, really nicely detailed. Or dress, I should say, not skirt. Oh, it could go both ways skirt, dress, or whatever. There's also a lot of wrinkles in her corset, which is also really nice. Give it a second to focus. What, yep. Um, yeah. Come on, Canon. You didn't have trouble before. Why now? Anyways, as my camera's trying to focus, there's a lot of details in this area. You know, let me just refocus by myself. So, anyways, as you can see, there's a lot of details in the corset. You see the wrinkles and the strings. And Saber herself. Very gentle expression. Which is the main reason I got it. Since most of my other figures have her in kind of like a dynamic pose, 
So I want a really simple savory. And this one caught my eye, in my opinion. I see a little cute ribbon. Back right here is very simple. And there you go. She has a very slender um, figure. Okay. And definitely the con of this whole figure is this damn base. I mean, of all the colors you could have chose from, why yellow, Alter? That still baffles me. I, I don't get it. They should have just went with clear, black, gray. Heck, blue would even look better. Red. At least match with the, the blade. Uh, speaking of the blade, there it is. You basically just slide it in her hand. Very simple. So, there you go. Of course, there's ruffles on her sleeve, too. Let's try to refocus that. There you go. You see the ruffles in there. And there's nothing much else to say. There's really no issues. It's a very simple figure. Nothing too extravagant, to be honest. And I think Alter did a nice job overall. So, overall, if you can find this figure and you're a big fan of the Saber, or a big fan of the Fate series slash Saber, I definitely recommend it. It's one of the smaller ones, and I wouldn't definitely pay a premium for it. Unless you're really, you know, you must collect all the Saber figures. But you can find her for like, you know, 60-ish. At most, 100. I mean, 100 is pushing it, in my opinion. That's pretty expensive for this kind of figure. But, yep. That's my review on it. Overall, I love it. Everything about it, except for the base. And feel free to leave comments or any questions below, and I'll gladly answer them. See you guys later.